Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to install the GCE editor to your Joomla installation. This is a award-winning, configurable, wide width editor. Joomla by default comes with TinyMC, which is a nice editor, but GCE has more functionality. So I'm now going to Phoenix MZ, MZ here, Mita. I'm going to go Extension Manager. I'm going to click on Upload Package File. I click on Choose File. I'm going to cl click on Download here. I'm going to click on Come GCE because I've already downloaded GCE. I'm going to click on Open. I'm going to click on Upload and Install. I'm going to wait. So GCE is now installed. And once it's installed, your editor will still be on TinyMC, MCE, here. So we go to System, we click on Global Configuration, and you see here Default Editor. We don't want it on TinyMC because nothing changes if you don't change this. So you click on this. And you click on Editor QCE. And then you click on Save and Close. And then you go to Content, Article Manager. Then I click on New to show you the difference with TinyMC. This is QCE. So it's it looks a bit more complicated than TinyMC, but you have a font family here, font size, color, and all kinds of table options here. You got ABC toggle spell checker here. So you even have a spell checker, a link, insert link, and uh, You can add some styles, background, background color, attachments, word spacing. It's just a little bit more difficult than a tiny MC editor. To just show you the difference, I'll go back to the. I go back to tiny MC. I'm going to show you the difference between the two. I'm going to tiny in MC. I'm going to save and close. I'm going to click on Article Manager. And I'm click on New. And this is tiny MC. So it's just more simple. And there are many other editors that you can try. Because Joomla extensions, Joomla editor, Joomla extensions, we got the, here we got the API key editor. So, Go to the extensions Joomla.org. This is the website with all the Joomla extensions in it. You're going to click on Browse Extension. And this is actually, if you have a Joomla website, this should be your favorite website. 
to carry with the extend but with the support form it's a, you can ask any type of question if you'd like to and I'm actually active on this forum I'm forever fan on this forum so any type of thing you can ask there or you browse extensions you can look for an editor if you don't like QCE you look for another editor you look at the uh, reviews I'm going to search editor there you go with editor and why she white CKE editor, I see that. CKE editor. So there are many, uh, many options here that you could try. And not just for the editors, but also for image styles, and, and you can add slideshows, extensions. You can find anything on here. Any idea you have, you can just search for it and install it the same way as I did with a GCE ed editor, because it always works the same way. You always go to the extensions, extension manager. You go to upload package file. You click choose file. And then you upload and install. It works the same for anything, for a template, for a module, for a component, anything you have to install. You do it here. Except for the upgrade of Joomla. That you, then you won't do that like that, but you will go to Joomla and uh, you see that it's already updated. But normally it will show you here if there's any update, I click on a button and it will update Joomla totally. I hope you like this tutorial and I hope you'll be back to my channel soon to fish and more of my tutorials.